Where? Where am I? Oh my god, is this an insane asylum? That's crazy! I'm not insane! I've just got crazy stuff around me! Plus the magic hand that lives in my head. Well, maybe I am a little crazy. Nothing interesting ever happened here. You'd think for a loony bean there'd be some excitement, but no. Just walking around a bunch of caged up sad people. I wish something interesting would happen. Just once. You need to stay in your cell. <laughs> Maybe they can't see my extra legs, but they will all soon know my true spider form. <laughs> For I am the Black Widow, and the Black Widow is hungry for me. <laughs> yes, the Black Widow is on the hunt for new flies. Come here, man. Come here, little flies. <laughs> the perfect maid. Well, that went surprisingly well. Now to escape the asylum itself without getting spotted. You saw him, didn't you? He's haunting me. He's saying such awful things to me. Such awful things. My imaginary friend is my imaginary fiend. My own worst enemy. And I can never be rid of him. You can see him, can't you? Can't you? Can't you get rid of him? If only I could stop imagining Joe. I could be rid of him. I could be happy again. I could go home to my family. But no, as long as he's here, I'll be here too. Why can't he just leave me alone? Why did I ever imagine of the biggest jerk ever in time in the first place? Oh God, why doesn't my imaginary friend like me? Only created me because you wanted a friend to hang out with. Well, guess what, idiot? Oh, look at this guy. He'd maybe be okay if I could get a drink or two into me. Heck, it doesn't even have to be wobbly pop. I'd give me right here for a nice cup of hot steam and tea. Oh, God, a nice cup would really take me mind off of this jerk. Me, first thing every morning. That cat's seen better days. Wow, her praise would mean a lot more to me if it wasn't so consistent and all-encompassing. Am I the first cat to get depressed from being praised too much? Is that in and of itself depressing? At least if I were alive, I could wish for the sweet release of death. Oh well, I guess I am pretty pretty. <laughs> oh, Mr. Whiskers, you're such a pretty kitty. You never meant to leave me, right? That's right, and soon you'll be all stuffed and sewn and ready to stay with me forever. Does Mr. Whiskers want a mousy to play with? He does. Well, then Mama will have to find one for you. Yes, she will. <laughs> huh. I can't distract myself with irregular verb forms forever. It's time I face the truth. There's no point in digging up anymore. It's all downhill from here. The only way to make my mark in this world is to dig all the way down to the center of the earth. This tunnel shall be an eternal monument to my sad, sad feelings. I will have dug, I will have been. Uh, excuse me, um, uh, are you guys cr 
crazy too, or, or do you like work here? I, I mean, do you work here and also you're sane? Dr. Crank, his eyes, they look into my very soul. I never want to see those eyes again. I will totally freak out if I see those eyes again. Uh, this is Ralph, and I'm a helmet? I'm helmet? I'm pretty sure I'm helmet. Ah, uh, don't they get it? Dr. Crank has nutty mad eyes. If I see them, I'll hyperventilate, sending all sorts of air out of my body. I'm not joking, self. I'll do it. breaks for lunch. I feel like we should have had a break for lunch at some point. Well, maybe this Oh, uh, yeah. Feels good. Feels great. Feels amazing. I want more of this juice. Juice me up, baby. Ladies will want to get with me when they find out I'm a dude with heated water. me, uh, sir, captain, skip, first mate, um, poop deck, guy, yeah, tis man that felled the mighty beast, and twas I that was that man that killed that mighty whale. <laughs> At last, the whale, me hearties! She lies conquered on these very shores. Yar. I just need to get back to her. Okay. I'm a piece of cheese. I'm a piece of cheese. I'm um, a... cheese does not talk. Oops. I'm a piece of cheese. You better take it from me. I'm the best tasting hunk of cheese you ever gonna see. All the little mousies wanna get all up on me. And all the little mold force best check it and see. Ain't no more than this. Firm yet yielding. Cheese and butter. I'm the big cheese. Yo, no more rep I'd say. Turn to the stars. Uh, uh, hello there. Hello there, young man. 
Can you help me? I'm from outer space, and I'd like to return, but I need my inflatable space duck back to return to the stars. To my planet. To my people. You're... an alien? Yes, of course. Oh, I see why you're confused. I'm an alien, but I'm wearing a human suit. Only the zipper got stuck, and now I can't take it off. Life's funny, huh? Uh, yeah. Ha. <laughs> Huh? You'll help me, won't you? You don't think I'm crazy, do you? I, I make it a policy not to lie to old ladies, so all I will say is, um, have a good one? Why, young man, you're trying to read my thoughts. On my planet, you at least ask a lady first. But you're not doing this on purpose, are you? There's something else in there helping you. It has a name. Red, Jed, Ted. Hello, Ted. It's nice to make your acquaintance. Okay, one more. <laughs> oh, thank you, thank you, thank you. You've returned my face floaty to me. I am in your debt, young man, and I won't forget this. Farewell. Whoa. That was unexpected. Well, maybe this one. Sleepiness under control. To see you dance, let's see you shake your booty in your pants. If you want to move to music, then I guess here's your chance. Transmodulate the inverted phase. The primary biofilm emitter should be able to be modified to. Bro, dude, can't you just like chill for one minute? I want to get freaky! Note to self, it appears my split personality syndrome seems to be reasserting itself. Self-diagnosis is- Darn right I'm reasserting myself! Dude, we've been working on this problem for hours! Let's party, man! Let's dance! I'm afraid dancing is out of the question. But if you submit a request form, 55 Dude, eight, just leave forms out of it, man. Let's just cut loose. Pro times. Let's dance in our pants, man. I'm afraid I don't hear anything worth dancing to. Now, please be quiet. Now, phase inversion of the Tatiri Matrix combined with... Why, Dr. Crank, I've never seen you dance at all before. There's a whole side of me you've never seen, baby. And please, call me Bob. Yeah, yeah, this is how we do it, Doctor. Dance it up, hands, we gotta take a chance on dance. He's so smart, but also... So good at partying. Is it perhaps the perfect combination? <laughs> Oh, 
Uh, does everything look like crazy all of a sudden to you, Ralph? What? Those, those eyes, those eyes! They found me! I'm freaking the heck out! Uh, wait, where are you going with me? Ralph, this is turning out to be a difficult day. I'm down. I'm still helmet? Listen, can I borrow that mouse? What? It's not like I had anything else going on. I can't distract it. Suddenly, I, I don't feel so depressed. In fact, I feel... What's the opposite of depressed? Non-pressed! Maybe, maybe digging down isn't the answer. No, the right thing to do is to dig up. Yeah. I'm finally in. Oh, I'm out. Where are you, Mr. Bunny? Time for a tea party. What the? We seem to have a security breach. Ronald is back, and he has dug himself a new tunnel. Uh, please set a guard down there to patrol it. Come on, Harry. Get a hold of yourself. Sure, there's rumors of the ghost of a dead little girl down here. Sure, you spent all last night watching horror movies. And sure, you're working the graveyard shift, the one shift most likely to have ghosts show up. But that doesn't mean there's actually ghosts down here. Maybe that noise was, uh... A tea party! Yes, a delightful tea party. Nothing to be afraid of here. Nothing to fear, but fear it's... Ah, what was that? No way am I going near her. I learned long... I walk this earth and can never die. If you want to kill me, don't even try. I'll stay here forever till I get what I need. And that's to make a certain naughty bunny bleed. Anything in this? A whole tea set, all in one sticker. I don't mind if I do. Oh, thanks, dude. Oh, if only I could stop imagining Joe. I could be rid of him. I could be happy again. I could go home to my family. But no, as long as he's here, I'll be here too. Why can't he just leave me alone? Why would I ever imagine of the biggest jerk ever in time in the first place? Oh, God, why doesn't my imaginary friend like me? You only created me. <laughs> Look, I wanted a friend to hang out with. <laughs> Is that tea? Mr. Bunny, you finally came. Ah! I was so, so angry. No, 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 not you again! Ah! All right, Harry, you've passed out once again. But don't worry. While you're unconscious, me, your subconscious, is going to regale you with stories that I make up as I go along and which don't really make sense. Uh, okay, so you're back at home, only it's not really your home, it's school. 
And you're writing an exam, only you haven't been to class all semester. You're going to fail. And you're, you're naked? Ugh. Harry, what trouble have you gotten yourself into this time? Anyway, I'll let that sink in for a while, because soon I'll make things even weirder. Where are we going? Listen, I'll just follow you till you give me that mouse, okay? Can I have that mouse yet? What? What? Clear! Damn it, nurse! Mouse. Why aren't these working? Mouse. This stub toe isn't going to electrocute itself. Where's my nurse? Where's my electricity? Why am I even here? I just stubbed my toe. I'll just pee. Dang, the traffic here is terrible. It feels like we've been stuck for days, weeks, years. Where are we going? Uh, this battery's dead. It can maybe be recharged, though. Uh, that's how batteries work, right? <laughs> Let's make the next one a double! This battery is now charged. Thank you! Oh, uh, yeah. Feels good. Feels great, Barton. Wait, do we get breaks? Ah! Oh, okay, one more. Ah! Ha! 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 It's a giant dead whale. That that would explain it. Ye found her, and she's as beautiful as the day I first laid eyes on her. And as she was two days later when I killed her with me bare hands. By Poseidon's swim trunks, I'd wager all it'll take is a few stitches and some air, and mark my words, we'll have a raft. I... Okay... So the matter is closed! I hate Mondays! Ralph, this is Kurt. Ralph, Ralph. Dear, I've never seen a more beautiful whale corpse in all me days. Now, all we need is to blow her up like an inflatable raft. Listen, I'll just follow you till you give me that mouse, well, okay? here we are. Back at scenic, giant, stinky, split-open dead whale point. Oh my gosh. She's so huge. So tremendous. To turn this whale into a stunning piece of taxidermic art would be my greatest challenge yet. I... I must try. There. Isn't she beautiful? She certainly is a beautiful, decaying, sewed-up whale. I know, right? Now all we need is some stuffing for her. Yar, tis not stuffing we be after. We need to turn old whaley here into a raft. We need air, you scurvy land lovers. Of course. This all makes perfect sense. Hmm. Wrong sticker. Dear, I've never seen a more beat. 
Ralph. Air is... Well, air is cheaper than a whole whale-sized box of stuffing. Oh, thank you, thank you, thank you! Blowing into a bag is the only thing that calms me down sometimes, you know? Yar, we're almost there. We just need some juice and we'll be in business. Uh, electricity? It'd be the final step, you minnow. Okay, you're the boss. I hate Monday! I'll show ye how it's done. It's alive! Alive! <laughs> so, we can leave now? No! Instead, let's get it once more! Yeah!